it's a matter of uh, great pride and uh, joy uh, that uh, Jammu Kashmir uh, police personnel, officers and men, have uh, been uh, bestowed uh, with uh, as many as 72 gallantry medals on the eve of uh, Republic Day celebration by the President of India and the Government of India, um, which is, uh, as I learned uh, from the Ministry of Home Affairs website, we are the highest gallantry medal winners uh, uh, with, uh, as far as the state police forces are concerned, uh, Chhattisgarh police also have uh, won 26 gallantry medals. And uh, when it comes to all forces, including the uh, Central Armed Police Forces, the CRPF uh, is also another proud force to have won 65. Uh, in matters of uh, uh, competing with uh, uh, fellow police services in uh, uh, laying down the highest uh, or st traditions, standards of uh, police service, uh, uh, showing a conspicuous gallantry, gallant act in defending the motherland and uh, ensuring protection of our people, life and limbs of our citizens, JNK police once again has uh, stood out. I compliment uh, all officers and men and congratulate uh, the award winners uh, I also take this opportunity to uh, express uh, uh, the gratitude of the JNK police uh, on my behalf and on behalf of uh, all of us and men to uh, the government, UT government of JNK led by the Honorable NG and uh, uh, the uh, Union government, uh, Ministry of Home Affairs for their uh, consideration and uh, special affection and uh, consideration for uh, Jammu and Kashmir police. As I have been sharing this information with certain amount of poignant pride uh, that uh, since the inception of uh, this uh, violent phase of uh, terror and intimidation, uh, separatism and uh, Pakistan-sponsored proxy war uh, in about last 33 years we have lost more than 1,600 police personnel and that's uh, by far the largest amongst all security forces uh, including the central armed forces in Jammu and Kashmir. So uh, that uh, actually uh, is, the, uh, is the benchmark or should I say the high water mark in terms of, uh, uh, of, of uh, demonstrating uh, the commitment uh, to to the to the uh, national security uh, effort, but more than the 1,600 men who have actually uh, died in the line of duty, there are scores, uh, hundreds of others who have suffered injuries, who have suffered displacement, who have suffered a variety, a varying degrees of uh, uh, vilification, intimidation. Um, family dislocation. Many have suffered attacks on their families, have lost uh, members of their family uh, because of having worked in police and because of having worked uh, towards national security effort in Jammu and Kashmir. Those are tales, those are uh, sagas of, uh, uh, of, of uh, untold uh, stories which uh, actually uh, is not well chronicled. Often at the highest level of the government, including the Prime Minister and the uh, Honorable Union Home Minister, they have uh, uh, acknowledged this and have uh, many times uh, sort of uh, uh, underlined that uh, a, a, a time has come when JNK police and others should make an effort of chronicling these uh, stories, individual stories, as well as the collective effort of uh, the Jammu and Kashmir police and its members uh, in, in their fight against uh, terror. 
uh, and to maintain the sovereignty and integrity of India as far as Jammu and Kashmir is concerned. Well, uh, the security arrangements are very much in place. Uh, uh, we have held at state level, at province level, security meetings uh, uh, and consulted, discussed amongst ourselves, all stakeholders, uh, army at the highest level, uh, CAPF led by CRPF or primarily uh, the, as the lead force and all other uh, security agencies, intelligence agencies. We have uh, a detailed plan. Uh, we have uh, taken care of the venue security. We have tried to take care of all possible threat scenarios and uh, devised our responses to contingencies. And we are sure uh, we would uh, uh, celebrate this with uh, peace. And uh, we would request all members of the citizenry to participate with full fervor and uh, festivity.